Why are you speaking that over my life in a lot of ways in which we can't explain? But now if you're talking to me, now we still may be hard-headed because we're kids. We're, we're adolescents. You know, we don't really have too much rationalization that can go on in our mind because we just are ruthless. That's how most kids that, you know, that has no way in life or has no direction come up with very little. And the only thing they can do is adapt to their peers. And that's when the peer pressure comes in. But again, the difference between uh, the way you convey your message is is a big thing. Because kids going to do what kids want to do anyway. But what we're trying to convey is, listen, think about it before you squeeze that trigger. Think about it before you run around your homeboys, the one that has the gun. Because usually it may be a circle of kids and one of them may have a gun, came up on a ghost gun, a 380 or something. You better be careful you hanging around them because the minute that person pulls the trigger, bang, you're already guilty by conspiracy. You conspired to commit the act because you was with the person. Oh, I didn't know he was going to do it, but you knew he had a gun. Why else would he be carrying a gun on him? Oh, 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 but uh, 